हेलो एवरी वन होप यू ऑल आर फाइन टूडे ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ सी सी टी वी डेस्क वी कम अप विथ न्यू वीडियो दिस वीडियो इज ऑल अबाउट आ सी एम एस द सी एम एस नेम इज जियाओ वी वी फॉर विंडोज सो बेसिकली इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस विथ यू वॉट इट जिया फॉर विंडोज वॉट आर दिट आर इट्स फीचर एंड फंक्शन and after that we'll tell you minimum system requirement of this software and then we move to our video to our practical parts means how you get this file and how you install on your system and how you configure to make the camera live and able to access all its feature so keep watching till end please like share our video and subscribe to our channel if you are a new one so ziao vv is a cms or it is a software which is used to connect as well as control the cctv camera on pc it is also used to monitor the cameras on remote locations over the internet by using this software you are the main purpose of this software is that by using this software you are able to access live view of the camera not only the live view of the camera but you can access multiple channel at a time you watch the recording of the cameras you take the snapshot of the video you control the ptz camera to save the live view of the camera you can adjust image parameter like brightness color etc and you take a backup of the recorded videos and you control the quality of the video recording and many more now we'll tell you that how you get this file for this you should open browser any browser in my case i am i am using chrome so i open my chrome browser and search for ziao vv for windows and press enter when i search i found one of the favorite my favorite one here is why okay just open the website and this website not only tell you that how you get this file but also install and how you configure everything is mentioned by screen, using a screenshot okay so just download this app just click on this it will redirect to your page where we have to wait for only few second and once the second is completed then your file become ready to be downloaded here is your file just click on this download file and close this add and your file is start downloading now download is finish just click on this show in folder option it will redirect you to your download folder here is a downloaded file the side click on the downloaded file and click as extract to xpv when you do this you you get the folder name same as the file name just open the folder and here is your application file or exe file or installer file just right click on the application file and click as run as administrator and click okay now click next now click create a desktop shortcut just click install and it is totally automatic process your file start you it start installing once it is successfully installed you get that com complete this message like completing the xvv setup wizard just click launch xvv and click finish when you do this the software will automatically open so here is the interface of the software first thing you should do you should make a register account just click here click go to register and here it asks for a region then asia and here enter the email address like and here just enter a password and just click on the verification code when you click on the verification code email number already registered so i registered earlier that's why i need to close this this one and again open the software 
I just log in by using my email address. And enter the password. Just click auto login. If you tick auto login, then you don't need to pass enter password again and again. Just click the read and agreement and click login. So here is the interface of the software. Now what should you should do? You should here you can check the views of the camera. Single camera view, four camera view. And here the first thing you should do here is you find the lot of option like cloud notification center, my files, cloud services and many more. What you should do, you should click on this add group. Okay. When you click on the add group, here you see that two devices already add and just click group frame or anything. Okay. Like group my home and click save now here you find the setting option and here you find the option add device just click on the add device just close the all the things this is the interface and you should after creating group you should click on add device okay now one one thing you should remember that if your device and your PC means if your camera and your PC both are connected to the same network or a same router then you should click it will search automatic, automatically otherwise you should click on manually add by device ID let's click on manually add by device ID where you did you get the, the device ID it is mentioned on the camera sticker okay when you get this QR code is scanned you, you get the ID even the ID is mentioned this nine character just enter nine eight double zero and click add device now device is added again just click on go to the live view click any camera and your camera comes online thanks for watching thank you once again thank you have a nice day